This video is part two of the series on the pyramid view of the human body. The first video of this series stated that the human body behaves as if there is a pyramid inside of it. Here is a picture of a computer model pyramid. As can be seen in the picture, a pyramid has a rectangular base, four triangular sides that rise up some arbitrary vertical distance, and a point at the top where the four triangular sides meet. This picture was used to demonstrate the pyramid in the human body. The sides of the pyramid run from the ground up to the shoulders, then continue upwards until they meet at a point on the head. It was then pointed out that there is a natural triangle formed by the shoulders and the head as shown in this picture. The first video claimed that the presence of the natural triangle formed by the shoulders and head was cooperation for the validity of the pyramid view of the human body. It was claimed this natural triangle was the visible part of one of the sides of the pyramid within the body. This video will present more cooperating evidence for the validity of the pyramid view of the human body. Please examine this picture of a real-life human being. There is a clearly defined triangular shape on the man's head. The base of the triangle runs along the area between the man's forehead and the top of his head. The sides of the triangle rise up to the point at the top of the man's head. According to Happy Theory, the presence of this natural triangle on the head is more cooperation for the validity of the pyramid view of the human body. According to Happy Theory, the triangle on the head is also a visible part of one of the sides of the pyramid within the human body. This picture shows a close-up of the upper body of the human computer model. The outline of the triangle formed by the head and shoulders are drawn on this picture. Examination of this picture reveals that the triangle on the head is the top part of the triangle connecting the shoulders and the head, as indicated by the line drawn across the head on this picture. This connection between the triangle on the head and the triangle formed by the head and shoulders is more support for the validity of the pyramid view of the human body. The stronger and healthier a human being is, the more obvious and pronounced the triangle on the head will become. That claim is supported by the example picture. The man in this example picture is a professional fighter. A professional fighter would have to be strong and healthy. According to Happy Theory, the existence of the Egyptian pyramids is further cooperation for the claim that the stronger and healthier a human being is, the more pronounced and obvious the pyramid within the human body becomes. According to Happy Theory, a strong pyramid within the human body is associated with the development of strong mystical and spiritual powers. That fact is what inspired the Egyptians to build huge stone pyramids that could be seen for miles and would last for hundreds of years. The Egyptians were building monuments to the thing, a pyramid shape inside of the human body, that was the sign of a superior kind of human being, a human being who had developed strong mystical and spiritual powers. As support for the claim that a human being with a strong pyramid in their body will develop strong mystical and spiritual powers, Please examine this picture. This picture shows a man dressed as a wizard. A wizard is a human being who is supposed to have mystical and spiritual powers. One of the common items that is associated with wizards is the black hat he is wearing. The hat is cone shaped. A cone has a circular base as shown in this picture. The sides rise upward some arbitrary distance until they meet at a point as shown in this picture. That description should sound familiar. It is the same description as the description of a pyramid, except a cone has a circular base, while a pyramid has a rectangular base. In fact, a pyramid and a cone have the same triangular silhouette as shown in this picture. According to Happy Theory, the conical hat of a wizard is something like the pyramids of Egypt, whose invention was based on the pyramid within the human body. According to Happy Theory, the reason a wizard's hat is conical is because it is meant to represent the extension of the pyramid inside of the body up above the top of the head. The extension of the pyramid above the top of the head was meant to signify to an outside observer that the person who was wearing the hat was a superior person whose pyramid was so strong and healthy that they developed magical powers. The similarity between the triangular silhouette of a wizard's conical hat and a pyramid and the fact that wizards are associated with mystical and spiritual powers is support for the claim by Happy Theory 
that the Egyptians built the pyramids as a monument to the pyramid inside of the human body, whose development is associated with the development of mystical and spiritual powers.